Hello, hi. This is a demo of an InDesign uh, viewer which exists as a quick look plugin on a Mac. So, for those people who are working with InDesign, have all, always been trying to figure out a solution of how they can view their InDesign documents without InDesign. So, this is the solution. So, you don't need in InDesign installed on your Mac. For, I would like to clarify this. The only thing you need is this quick look plugin and then you will be able to preview your InDesign documents. Like you see in this video I have a InDesign document selected and I can still see the thumbnail of it. This is only possible with the help of this quick look plugin which is called Radio View. Now I'll show you some more features of it. So this is the full preview of your InDesign documents. It gives you a multi-page preview of your InDesign documents it has some more advanced options fit to width fit to height spread view this is a view for those people who are working with a spread layout in InDesign who want to see their bleed ads or <coughs> images which are flowing across the spread a very useful view for them gives you a complete thumbnails of all the pages you have on your InDesign document then it also has some information on the metadata. These are the fonts which have been used, true type, open type, links or assets linked to your InDesign document, colors used in your InDesign document. Also if you want to magnify certain areas of your document you can do that with the help of this magnifying lens. When you click on drag in the vertical upward direction the zoom percentage increases click and drag in a vertical downward direction the zoom percentage decreases if you click and drag on your left the area of the zoom decreases and if you click and drag on your right the area of the zoom increases a very convenient way to zoom into a certain section of a document it also has a zoom bar which you can use to zoom in and zoom out If you want some information you get some information over here they, there's also a user manual on the website which you can get by clicking on this particular icon apart from InDesign document it also supports illustrator postscript EPS files in copy files ASC files and Quark Express documents thank you okay. and now I'll give you an insight on how this uh, product works this works on JPEGs, JPEG previews of InDesign pages embedded within the InDesign document. To get best results, please make sure in your InDesign preferences under your file handling tab, you have the preview size set to extra large and you have the pages set to all pages. So this will help you with the pre this will help you when you are previewing your InDesign documents in ADO view. Thank you.